again. One, punch, and up. Again. One, punch. The movement is very simple, but a lot of people find it very difficult to understand how the movement works, yeah? So, for example, the clock, yeah? So, a lot of people think it's just a clock like this, but you, you can use four strike normally to do like this. Boom, straight to the throat, okay? So, it's not only block, okay? Another one, you see the, the frog and the punch, yeah? For example, Daniel the jump. So this one, for example, if you block the movement, if you don't want to hurt people, yeah? A lot of movement you go, you can just push them away like this, yeah? So you don't want to be here, yeah, you want to move to this side a little bit. If you don't go down, you can throw, punch towards the head, up, normally to the ribs, okay? Because open the muscles, more easy for stretch. If you don't want to go more, you know, it's too much tack. So you can use for throw, for example, if you, if, like, or we can form the step, yeah? So I'll step behind the foot. So I'll sink in my balance a little bit. I'll move my weight. So that will be more easier. So you make sure you go slightly a little bit lower for the throw, yeah? And also, if you want a little bit more action, you can use sand or use your elbow, yeah? So use elbow rather than use your shoulders. It looks very simple but a lot of application inside. But what I'd say in here is probably only 30% way of application. I have much much more of behind the movement, yeah, how you use the, the stunts. So all the traditional form come from basic, okay? Everything? Let's finish it. Sure, 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 sure.